good morning and welcome to another adventure of mine in the French Pyrenees actually today the plan is to leave France for a bit and uh, to go into Spain more about it later One hour 15 minutes into my adventure hike actually and I just passed the first so-called checkpoint it's the refuge refuge de la breche this name comes from a, a mountain pass under which the refuge is situated being La Breche de Roland which is now awaiting me up there I'm in España. <sighs> it's really rough. This terrain here, rough and beautiful. As you can see, only rocks, only stones. <sighs> nice. Short update, I am uh, at about 2800 meters above the sea level <coughs> and uh, I am almost 8 kilometers into my adventure with almost 800 meters of climb uh, 
I just met some guys who told me that I have about an hour and a half of walking uh, until actually uh, a lake, a uh, frozen lake, which is at the bottom of today's goal, which I, I'm going to reveal now. It's the Monte Perdito, Perdido, Mont Perdu, the lost mount, the third highest of the Pyrenees. Uh, it's 3,355 meters. Exciting. Uh, I am two hours, 40 minutes into my adventure and uh, feeling very well, excited. It's very beautiful here. The weather is nice. <sighs> what more to say? I'd like to show you those rocks. They are very, very cool. If you look at them, they look very smooth. But if you touch them, they're really, really grippy. It's very nice to when you have to climb on them. You can't imagine how happy I am. It's the first time that I see Edelweiss in the mountains, in uh, the nature. Wow, really, look at them. They are so beautiful. Right, I started the final ascent of the summit. Let me show you what's in front of me and what I still have to walk up the hill. On the camera it doesn't look very impressive, but believe me, in reality it is about 300, 350 meters of climb that are left there in less than a kilometer. Let's go. Now it's the really final push to the top. I started descending from Monte Perdido and the toughest part in the descent is just going to start. The top is there and all of this descent is very, very unstable. So almost down to the lake.
I met this couple of French hikers who are actually doing exactly the same as me started at the Col de Tente went up to the Monte Perdido and now uh, are returning so uh, we joined forces and are seeking for the right way to return to our car. I'm back at the Breche de Roland and uh, it's time for me to say goodbye to Eva and Jules. Goodbye! Bye -bye, uh, I'm going to try to run as much as I can. So, I'm back at the car, but I didn't finish quite as I would like, I would have liked to. About a couple of hundreds of meters before the finish, I fell. It's on this smooth path that the proximity of the finish made me lose my concentration. I stumbled and fell on the gravel. With two quite bad cuts, full of sticky stone dust, I hobbled the last kilometer to the car and headed to the emergencies of the town of Lourdes. After a couple of hours of waiting, I was rewarded with a cleanup and stitches on my right knee and hand. So uh, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If so, put a thumbs up and uh, subscribe for more. Bye bye.